good morning good afternoon good evening good night depending on when my video gets to you please guys do well to subscribe to this my youtube channel also turn on the notification bell in order to get notified whenever i upload a new video thank you so much god bless you so guys except that uh, it is always joyful to talk about liquor rose otherwise in this video today i want to bring up to you some celebrities that you dare not drag them on social media in actually guys when it comes to online dragging there are some celebrities who should be given accolade for their swift response because if you think their celebrity status would deter them from fighting back then you are wrong these celebrities give us pure content as they are never dry for words they know how to give accurate drop bags in ways that would woo you this there are a good number of them but let us stick to the top seven number one bob risky the nigerian crossdresser and self-acclaimed snapshot baby is a no-go area there is no way in hell you will fight bob risky and she won't fight you back she would never let you go scot-free after insulting her, but will drag you inside the mud irrespective of who you are. Or The worst part of it all is if Bob is familiar with some of your dirty secrets, she will drag you by the horns by exposing your dirty secrets to the world with photos, documents, videos, anything available as a proof. Few weeks ago, Bob had a very good fight with Toto DK, his best friend including Monfa. They dragged Monfa into their fight. The fight became so serious, a lot of secrets were exposed, a lot of talks, a lot of words. In fact, it was like a war on social media to the extent that Monfa even threatened to charge Bob to court before Bob later came on social media to apologize to Monfa, bringing up his sweet, sweet words to make sure that the mind of Monfa is softened. A second person is Tonto to decay. It seems Tonto Let's respond is usually based on her mood because sometimes when she is expected to respond, she won't. But if Tonto decay decides to respond, this light skinned actress will not just clap back with words. She is definitely involving the police and issuing your ass. Tonto doesn't get tired once she starts. My people, my people, once Tonto to start, eh? she could go more than days, weeks, months, she is dragging you on social media, one after the other, one problem to the other, Tonto is dragging you. A clear case of Tonto and Popogri that just ended, I don't even know if it has ended, but the two dragged each other. Popogri was also ready for Tonto to decay, the two as if they just programmed them that let these two come together and start dragging this lasted for months the dragging resulted to police court case and all of that they drag each other some seize each other vehicles and the rest of other things another one that happened even before the popo gris own is when Tonto drag her first husband Olakunle Churchill Tonto drag Churchill like a past my neighbor generator he drag Churchill oh Churchill got tired of his life got tired of this eggs eh? what did she not say about Churchill insults everything exposure every secret Tonto knew about Churchill then she exposed it as if Churchill wasn't her husband. It's better not to look for Tonto's trouble because if you look for her trouble, you're sending yourself to hellfire. She'll give it back to you. So guys, moving forward, the third person is Reno Omokre. When you think you have seen it all, that is when you will know that Reno Omokre is nobody's mate in the dragon industry. His own style is quite different as he will not only insult you intelligently, he will educate you on top of it. Quoting the Holy Bible, if need be, in a very long message, this ex-presidential aide does not know how to respond with short messages. It has to be a long letter to you. Reno can finish you intelligently. You won't even know that he is insulting you. After insulting you, he will educate you and throw more light on what he has said on top of your head. Let us listen to what he just said recently about President Muhammad Buhari. I had told the NFF not to allow General Muhammad Buhari speak to the Super Eagles. Now, this wasn't politics. A lot of people thought it was politics. It's not politics. And then today, when I heard that he had spoken with them, I mean, I was really upset. I was quite sad. You see, you have to understand, look, people have energies. Whether we like it or not, it's a fact of life. 
people have energies whether you call it vibration spirit people have energies if you read the book of job 32 8 it says there is a spirit in a man all of us have spirits you know we have vibrations some of them are good energies some of them are bad energies look general muhammad buhari let's face it the man has a bad energy you know he has the reverse of the midas touch everything he touches turns to dust Look at what happened with Anthony Joshua. And he go back, I said the same thing with Anthony Joshua. Avoid this man. He didn't. He consulted with the man. Look at what happened. He lost. He lost to uh, uh, Alexander Usyk. And then the same thing with the previous um, um, Afghan. He did the same thing. And then our guys were eliminated. Look, this man, because look, there, there are things beyond the natural. You know, this man, there are things that people like I know. You know, and it's not everything we can say. This man, the places he's gone to, the kinds of marabouts he's been with. That's why we said, do not talk to these boys. Let them focus. He is a distraction. Who has Buhari? Now, this is a question I'm asking for Buhari supporters. Who has Buhari called and they have won or it has been a positive effect on them? Who? The man! This is not luck because I don't believe in luck. These are deep spiritual forces in action. And you know, I'm very, very sad because this could have been averted. Anyway, you know, it has happened. And I pray that the NFF and other sports lovers, not just in football, anything, look, divorce this man from our sporting activities. My name is Renan Mokri, and I thank you for. We also have Yabo Jo in this dragging industry. Yabo Jo seems to be coded in her dealings because one minute she is showering you with the trending TikTok challenge videos and the next she is in a live Instagram video dragging anyone draggable. This talented actress does not get scored and you don't want to see her angry because once she is, it's difficult to quench that anger. You can tell from her live videos when she decides to reply anyone she thinks has wronged her. To mention but few, Frank Edoho is a member of the dragging industry, almost similar to Remo Omokre. Frank Edoho is another man you don't want to be caught in crossfire with. Once this seemingly cool-headed man decides to respond to you, then go and get your dictionary because he will definitely make you feel you should ask for a refund from your English teacher in primary and secondary school. There is no way you are going to win so it's better to just accept defeat and look away. Actor Jim Ike is also in this category that you dare don't drag them on social media anyhow because if you start, you get yourself to blame. If Jim Ike answer you that you are dragging him on social media, it is either you're ready to fight or you're ready to get it hot from him. He doesn't joke at all. Many have received slaps, some have received good insults because they have made an attempt to drag him on social media. So guys, at this point, I want to say a very big thank you for following me up. Very big thank you for watching. Stay tuned for the next update that comes your way soon till we meet again some station. Bye.